Today guys, I'm gonna show you how to make cream of rice. It's really easy, but you get a lot of questions about it. So first off, the cream of rice itself. I use complete strength cream of rice. I use the caramel biscuit flavor. Now, the whey, this is literally just by choice. You don't have to have the whey. I use Train by JP. I use the rich chocolate cake, which is rich. <laughs> it is rich, but it's a really, really, really good flavor. Really good product. Now, I use 140 grams of cream of rice and I use one and three quarters of a scoop of weight at the minute. That's just what, what fits my macros the best. So that's what I run with. So what I do is I use 50 mils of semi-skim milk, literally just for the sake of it, it's a little bit more creamier. I then top the rest up with boiling kettle water. The reason being is because it's boiling, it makes it just mulch all up together, it's really nice. So if I've got 170 grams of powder, I would normally go for 180 grams of liquid. Some people just go for complete milk, some people just go for complete water. I like a bit of a mix between the two. So here we go. So you've got 50 mils of milk. We then run with the, with the rest of it. More often than not, you're pretty good with a one-to-one -one ratio. So if you've got 100 grams of powder, you should, you should be okay with, um, you should be okay with 100 grams of liquid and all you're doing just with a fork just mix it on through and you should get a nice almost like a not necessarily a mousse but not necessarily just a liquid mixture obviously depending on the consistency that you do like will depend on obviously how much water you do put in but i do find that a one-to-one -one ratio is always is, is always a good place to start and then from there you can just mix and match as you go I like to top mine with a couple of strawberries, again, just for an extra little bit of carbs, but also just for the sake of, it just gives that cream and rice, just that little bit of a sweet flavor. Um, and yeah, cheers for watching guys. I'll see you in the next one.